Hello everyone, welcome back to the Chanel. How are we doing? How are you guys doing? Are you enjoying yourselves? I hope that you are all enjoying whole week as the chaos continues. I was gonna say commences, but as it continues. Today I actually think I have what will be my favorite brand of the week. I am so, so impressed with the stuff that I've got in today's video. Remember, all of these videos this week are unspon unsponsored in my honest opinions. I keep it real with you guys anyway, but just if you are curious, you know, all of these bits and bobs are not like paid advertorials or anything like that. I am blown away by Boohoo. I mean, Boohoo is a brand that I've been watching a little bit lately and I feel like they have just been killing the game with the stuff that they've been bringing out. I have been loving so, so much of their stuff. So I knew that they were a brand that I wanted to include in this week's videos because I don't actually like show you guys the stuff I buy from Boohoo anymore, really. So they were a brand that I really wanted to include and I'm really, really excited about this one. But let's start out with my outfit. No, let's not start on my outfit. Let's start out with me telling you to subscribe. Check me out on Instagram, grab yourself a cup of tea, sit back and relax. I hope your week's going good. Um, I hope you enjoyed yesterday's video. Everything I mentioned is going to be linked below. And if you want to see these pieces styled up, I think I'm actually keeping everything in this video. So you'll definitely see it on Instagram if you want to know how I would kind of wear it. That's enough babbling. I'm going to jump straight into it. This little top that I have on is actually Zara, but I've styled it with the first kind of little outfit that I want to share with you that I love. This is a really cute little kind of short tracksuit co-ord. Obviously they do this as well in joggers, but I just really, really liked this stuff from this collection from Boohoo. It's called the Design Studio Collection and I love it. So this is kind of like an oversized white zip up, which I don't know, I'm leaning towards these a little bit more at the moment. I'm liking the idea of layering and I'm just liking the idea of a hoodie that I can actually zip and unzip. I think it looks really, really cool as well over denim jackets, leather jackets, a nice zip up hoodie. So really loved this. It's a really nice fit on me. I think I got the top in a large and the shorts in a medium. So this is in a large. They do this in other colorways. Totally impressed. I think it looks really, really nice and it's just a really nice loungewear item. I know loungewear is... I feel like people are over it and I get it. Um, I think if like me you work from home still, it's like a core part of my wardrobe. But I can appreciate that a lot of people are done with it. But I did want to shout out this little tracksuit. Let me move this rail. These are the little shorts that I also wanted to just shout out. I got these in a medium. Um, I potentially could have got a large in these, but I actually quite like the fit of them. Really, really cute. They pair nicely, obviously, with this little top that I've put on from Zara. And then this, this is just like, you need to go and do errands or something, or if you're just running around the house, because I know it is getting a little bit colder now for shorts, but I still wear this kind of thing a lot. Does anyone else? Um, and I definitely just wanted to kind of add another little cord piece to my wardrobe. I will link this as well as some of the other ones that Boohoo do. I don't have a discount code with Boohoo, sadly, but I think I might be able to find a few on the internet. So if I find some, I will actually link those codes below because I know some of you guys might want a code. Next up, I have this super cute checked plaid shirt. I'm not going to talk about the items too much. I'm just going to throw them on now, particularly for Boohoo, just because I've got so many items um, that I want to make sure I get through them all quite quickly. Oh my God, I love this. I mean, I love a plaid shirt. This is something I live in when it comes to autumn, winter. Grab this one in a large and it is definitely oversized i mean it's hitting me like just above my knee which is perfect i love that really really like obnoxiously kind of off the shoulder boxy feel for me plaid shirts are like a staple thing when it comes to autumn in particular i think they're a really nice layering piece they're just handy to like bring out you can obviously tie them if you don't want to wear them nice to just wear under like leather jackets and you know the list goes on and on you could do something like this i think as a dress um with you know chunky boots or you can do it open how i've got it on now you can do it with jeans i feel like it's just very very easy i love the color of this the kind of chocolate brown with a little bit of blue in it i thought that was very different i love a plaid shirt i honestly think that this is a staple piece in my wardrobe blazer and a plaid shirt very core to me but i just really like it and i think even like i just said earlier i've you know thrown it on with these white shorts again as a loungewear thing it's a really nice thing to just lounge around in and feel comfortable loved this one from boohoo so i'll be sure to link this exact plaid shirt you will definitely see me wearing this one like no doubt about it absolutely everywhere on social media so really happy with this i'm actually gonna just throw on top of this um a gilet because i want to show it to you i'm so desperate to show you guys this gilet this gilet is the same, if not better quality than the Zara one that I showed you guys this week. Um, this particular one I actually grabbed in a UK 12. Love the fit of it. 
the colour, I really hope this is still in stock, is gorgeous. And I think this is a colour that's going to be very popular again this year. This really nice kind of chocolate brown. And just how nice does it look with my plaid shirt? I really like that with some jeans or something. A nice little layering piece, but I love this gilet guys this is a really nice quality gilet it's actually quite padded and thick and the zip's really nice it just yeah really impressed with boohoo quality like i just and i'm going on and on but i really am impressed with boohoo quality you guys should see um a little try on clip here next to me it is just lovely like you guys can hopefully see that um it has the pockets it also has these little tie things at the bottom if you want to kind of bring it in a little bit i don't know i don't know what it is but I am really, really loving this gilet from Boohoo. It just feels really, really nice. A couple of the bits I also grabbed from Boohoo in this video, by the way, are from Boohoo Men. So shop the whole website. I believe in shopping the whole store. Like, you know, there's certain stores where you really feel this, like, gender divide. And then there's certain stores where you don't. And I think some of the nicest things I've found have been in the men's section. And it just really... That's never bothered me. So that's irrelevant to the gilet. But I just wanted to let you guys know some of the things I found out from Boohoo Man. This is so nice. I honestly cannot recommend this one enough. It feels really, really warm as well. So if you're umming and ahhing between the Zara one and the Boohoo one, I mean, I don't know what the difference is in price. But this is really nice quality. Like, I'm super impressed. I just really like the fit of this gilet. I'm gonna do a little bit of a miss next just to get it out of the way. Oh, I'm gutted about these. I was so excited about them. There's some cargo trousers from Boohoo. Um, they're called the wide leg cargo trouser. I got them in a 10. Sometimes I find Boohoo runs quite big, so I thought I would go for the 10. Rookie error, you guys will see on the try on, I can't do them up. So there's not really too much point in me showing you them. I am gonna actually go back on the website and order them in a 12. This fabric has zero stretch i should have known better i like the idea of a cargo i think it changes things up from a pair of jeans and a pair of like weather uh, leather look leggings the fabric is just nice it's very easy to style it's kind of a little bit more edgy i feel so yeah i am really down to find a nice pair of cargo trousers i did recently find some that i actually did like from pretty little thing i'm just pretty sure it's pretty little thing so i'll link them below um but yeah i I don't know. I want to love these. And I think if I got the right fit, the fit would be so nice. Because they fit really lovely on the bum. So I'm going to definitely size up and get the 12 in these. Because I really want them to work. And I think cargos are really handy for autumn. So next up I have this sweatshirt from Boohoo Man. I think loads of you are going to love this. I think they do this in another colourway. But I just fell in love with this kind of beige neutral colour. I got it in a men's large. And it's like my dreamiest sweatshirt fit. It's that lovely oversized feel. Has Colorado on it. It gave me very like Delaney Childs kind of vibes. If you follow Delaney you'll know what I mean. That sort of vintage, slightly worn sweatshirt again something that i live in in the winter i like that we're kind of making these a bit preppy at the moment with the sweater vests and the little collars and that sort of style i'm so here for this is just such a essential piece in my wardrobe um it just feels vintage and i like that about sweatshirts i like them to look a little bit worn or feel a bit aged i think it adds a nice element to them you could throw on the plaid shirt like over this um and that would look really cool too because it's all kind of the similar sort of color palette i absolutely love it i think it's so so cute yeah, so a bit of me. Boohoo do some really nice sweatshirts, particularly in the men's section, like I was talking about. Another way that I would definitely want to, like, style this up is with this gilet that I grabbed. <gasps> Another gilet. Guys, what's happening to me? Am I going to be wearing welly boots? And, like, I don't know. I really don't know. I just love a gilet at the moment. This lighting's okay, by the way. Let me know if the lighting is a bit low. Like, do I look a little bit like I'm telling a ghost story? Should it be a bit higher? Is it creating a shadow? Let me know in the comments. Totally want to hear your feedback this week. And I won't be filming in here for long. I will be filming in my new house soon, which would be nice. Because I think I've got a lot of natural daylight there. So, yeah. You didn't need to know that, but I just thought I'd let you know. So, this I grabbed in a medium. And I got it on Boohoo. And I love it so much. I love that it's kind of like this Borg. Again, would look so, so nice with something like this. Like, I've got on. And you could do just some joggers. Some of those, like, beige kind of trousers I showed you guys in Zara. The Zara haul. Um, black jeans like the list is kind of endless I love this little pocket detail and the collar and yeah I just think it is really nice I think this fabric is so nice it adds a new element to an outfit and again it's a nice layering piece I do love the gilets I don't know what I'm gonna do when it gets to like freezing cold weather because can you wear a gilet I feel like you can't I feel like you have to wear like a proper coat but I did just want to shout this out because I mean it is just the cutest 
like little gilet moment and it just pairs perfectly with this color sweatshirt so i'm loving this moment together next up i'm going to show you essentially the reason why i made this order the jacket of the moment ladies and gentlemen it's her so again this was a piece that i found on the, the um boohoo men's section they do this in another really cool color combo that i'm also eyeing up it's like black and red i'll leave it linked below i'll leave lots of my favorite pieces linked below even if they're not included in this video i might have just stumbled across them since filming so i got in a large i'm unsure if i should have got the extra large let me know below i'm actually going to take the sweatshirt off so i can try it on and you guys can see it a lot better one second this is the dreamiest jacket think ever i absolutely adore it so it's this kind of nude and black um motorcycle style jacket i think it's really cool i loved it on the website i love it even more in person the quality of this is so nice it's actually quite like warm it's not super thin you could layer with this do like a hoodie underneath the jacket speaks for itself i don't think you need too much extra to go with it I just think it looks like a really expensive piece it looks like something you would get in like a vintage store or yeah i just i loved it like i love the neckline of it i think it's really really cool has quite a kind of boxy feel like i mentioned this is in a large so this is a jacket that i feel is quite slim fitting on most men so it sort of depends the fit you want to go for if you want to keep that super you know nice fitted jacket maybe stick to like a smaller size or your regular size if you want something that feels a little bit boxy definitely size up but you won't be getting like a huge jacket with this but i like that i think this with some black skinny jeans some really chunky biker boots and like a hoodie underneath is so cool i i love it i love the detail down the arm again the quality on something like this feels so nice so so impressive boohoo quality in this video i cannot stop raving about them and like i said this video is 100 percent unsponsored like these are my honest thoughts i'm just so impressed with all of the bits that i've ordered and all of the bits that i've received i am kind of blown away except i have this skirt from boohoo again shock um i grabbed this one in a uk 12 and it fits me really nicely it's definitely like quite form fitting so if you're unsure on what size to go for maybe size up rather than down if, if like me you're in between two sizes i'm glad i went for the 12 i think is what i'm trying to say um i really like this it's kind of a take on a tennis skirt you know tennis skirts seem to still be in for autumn winter which i like i love this sort of shaped skirt this is in kind of like an off gray i just thought gray was a nice layering layering was a nice shade to layer with other colors like black um which is kind of like a staple color that i wear a lot in winter so that was sort of why i opted for this i think you could do some tights with it you could do some shoes like this that i've been just loving at the moment a chunky kind of loafer or you could do like a classic biker boot yeah i mean if you guys want styling videos for autumn winter definitely let me know in the comments i feel like that's a whole other separate video that i want to do um that aren't haul videos but I love a bit of styling and i think there are so many ways that you can take skirts and things maybe from your uh, more summer wardrobe and definitely transition them over to winter so i'm really liking the tennis skirt thing it's kind of a nice take on it it has sort of like more of a i don't know here is the tennis bit and then here's sort of like a random piece of fabric but i'm enjoying that um so i wanted to shout out this little skirt because i thought it was really really cute this jacket i got in a uk 12 and i just loved the back of this so on the back it says chicago the colours are really out of my comfort zone. I'm very intrigued about how I would wear this. Um, let me know in the comments because I do like the jacket at the back. It's definitely more of that sort of like street style. It would look really cute with some of my like Nike dunks. So here I have like my blue Nike dunks. I feel like that would pair really nice with a sort of jacket like this. But I mean, it's definitely throwing me off from the front. I think it's the red. I never wear red. Is it a bit High School Musical? Oh, now I've said that out loud, I can't unsee it. I'm getting Zac Efron High School Musical, you know, Corbin Blue. That's the vibe I'm getting. But I do really like the Chicago kind of, you know, lettering across the back and the way it's sort of like 3D. Um, but I think it's just the colourway I'm not so sure on. The red and the blue. Oh, now I've said this, I like can't unsee it. So it'll be really interesting if I keep this because I'm really, really confused what i actually think about it um let me know in the comments sorry there's like a massive spider in the corner of my room and i'm actually not scared of spiders at all but i obviously am because this is really grossing me out looking at it probably for the 80 percent of this video so well done if you noticed that i was you know frighteningly looking to the right hand side there's nobody there i'm fine it's not some sort of youtube scandal but there is a spider and i'm not sure about him 
Um, so yeah, I don't know, I'm not sure about this jacket either. Let me know in the comments, is this something I should keep or is this something I should be returning? Clear little piece that I have actually shown on my YouTube channel previously, but I just wanted to share with you quickly here because I don't know how many of you saw my blazer video. I'll leave it linked below, but I did share this blazer from Boohoo. And I feel like this is the perfect autumnal chocolate brown blazer. It's not the thickest, but it's, again, a nice layering piece. I will link this one below. Um, I just think it's really good to wear, like, on nights out, in the day. You know how I feel about blazers. I don't need to keep telling you. I love the chocolate colour. Pairs really nicely with neutrals, whites, creams, anything like that. Um, so I just wanted to shout this blazer out because I had mentioned it. And I don't know how many of you saw that video. So yeah, Boohoo blazers are some of my faves. That's actually it for everything Boohoo. I do have a coat that I just want to try on for you all. Um, this coat is from House of CB. So we're really jumping from two different brands here. But I didn't know when else to include it this week. And I really, really wanted to share it with you. I'm going to try and link a similar one from Boohoo below. Because I think I may have seen one on the website. It is a cropped chocolate brown puffer and i love it now the reason why i wanted to mention this is this coat retailed for 100 pounds in house of cb which yes it is a lot of money i am in no way suggesting that 100 pounds is not a lot of money but when you compare that to some of the other things in the store like some of their little crop tops are like 69 pounds <clears throat> i think 100 pounds is definitely like i was happy to pay it because the quality feels incredible so I just wanted to kind of shout out if you're going to buy one puffer coat this season. Um, they do it in a really nice stone colour. I really was into the chocolate. I mean, it just is such a gorgeous chocolatey colour. I got it in a medium. It goes from extra small to large. I'm going to pop on those white shorts just so you guys can see it a little bit better. Okay, guys, this is it. <gasps> I love her so much. She's definitely my splurge item of the week but i really really wanted to show you the coat i mean the fit is so nice it's a really nice cropped would look really nice with like high-waisted jeans it's definitely going to keep you warm um it feels roomy but like a nice amount of roomy and i totally fell in love with it the other color that they do in this coat is also gorgeous so i just wanted to make you all aware if you're on the hunt for like a really nice chocolatey brown puffer coat that maybe isn't north face um is like another brand or you just can't find one that you've been loving i wanted to let you guys know about this one from house of cb you can do it all the way up to the top it's coming up on camera quite maroon in person it is like just a true chocolate color so i don't know why it's coming out so maroon it might be my lighting that's a little bit funky today but it's a really beautiful chocolate color and i love this coat i want to like sell all my other coats because this coat is like the coat of the moment so yeah i'm really really happy so that is actually it for today's video i really really hope you enjoyed um i tried to be a lot more succinct with this one so let me know in the comments if you prefer it when i'm just like straight to the point obviously lots of other haul videos coming this week so make sure you guys are subscribed your notification bell is turned on you're following me on instagram all my other accounts i'm really excited to show you guys my homeware haul which also will be in this week's videos and yeah i'm just having a really good time i hope you guys are too thank you so much for watching as always i'll link everything that i talked about below overall i was really impressed with boohoo i think their stuff is great at the minute um i'm loving shopping on the men's site their men's pieces are really nice and yeah i'm just totally here for it. i mean this is one of my favorite things i think i'm gonna live in this this winter so i'm very very impressed with boohoo let me know in the comment section if you want to see more videos like this what other brands you guys want me to show and if you would be interested in a styling video don't normally do that kind of content but i kind of want to so i'd like to know what you guys want to see have a fabulous day as always i love you all so so much and i will see you all in tomorrow's video